Hello guys, today I want to break one common misconception about Laravel middlewares. So by default, typically people use middlewares for restricting something. So if something is wrong in the request or the permissions or whatever, they abort 403 forbidden or abort something or redirect to error page. So it's basically restricting something. But actually, middleware classes do not really force you to restrict anything. You can use middleware class as kind of a by class in the Laravel request. So you can set something in the middleware and then just move on without any abort or any redirect. So this is an example in a tweet by Philo Hermans. Here's the zoomed example. So in the handle method of the middleware, he's just setting the JSON other field, renaming something from JSON. So if, for example, you decide to rename the parameter of JSON from license CID to contact ID or something, you can do that in the middleware. So you just set something and then return next request like you would do in any middleware. Another example comes from our own quick admin panel. So if we go to any of our generated admin panels, you go to view code and in the code you open app HTTP middleware file called set locale. Again, let's zoom it in a bit. There's a handle method which takes care of the language. Language may come from session, from config or from get parameter in our case. And by the end of it, so we define the language by one of those methods and then we just set the locale to one of those languages. Again, there's no abort, there's no error handling here. We just set the global locale for Laravel project for the whole request and then return next request. So these are just two examples I wanted to show you. There may be many more. Add your own examples in the comments that you can use middleware not just to stop something from happening, but also changing the request, setting some global parameters, setting some session variables, and then moving on with the full request. If you want more Laravel tips like this one, subscribe to the channel and support my mission by subscribing to the membership of LaravelDaily.com to get courses and premium content there. That's it for this time and see you guys in other videos.